Hey guys, it's Strong Mom and I'm back with another video. Today we're going to talk about customizing our cell phones. It's honestly pretty easy. You just need a few things to get started. First, you'll go up to your store and you're going to buy customization kits. I always buy them in bulk and I try to just keep some in my pockets at all time, but if you don't have any, make sure to grab at least two to three. The next stop is the Nook Plaza. You're going to go ahead and you're going to grab your customizable phone case kit here. They cost 1,800 miles and one is good enough for now, but I did get two just to show you what would happen if you do change your actual image. The phone cases are sent from the Nook Stop to your mailbox, so I went ahead and time traveled to the next day, grabbed my presents and opened them up. This is where the actual fun starts in customizing your phone case. So you want to go to customize phone case and then it'll tell you this if it's the first time that you've done this. It's going to tell you that it will keep the custom design even if the design is changed later. So you have tons of options. You can go a solid color or you can go ahead and pick out a pattern. I'm going to quickly jump through some of these patterns just to give you an idea of what they're going to look like on your Nook phone and so that you can see which ones you want to get before you get started on customizing your own. You can also use your own custom designs. Right now I don't have anything really that neat to put on a phone in my custom designs, but if you wanted to go through and make a tile of say your family or your dog or whatever, you could definitely do that and upload your design and then put it onto your phone. I'm gonna go ahead and pick the blue pizza case for this time. I'm gonna make it, customize it, and I actually forget to show you, but it is there, it is the blue pizza. Now I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna actually go in and design from the actual design center. This is where you would go if you were gonna upload one of your own designs. Right now, I don't have anything that I wanted specifically on my phone, so I'm gonna go ahead and just type in phone as my criteria search. That way I can see maybe what other people have put on their phones and what they've designed already for this. You could look up honestly anything you wanted to do. I'm sure they have bears, dogs, people, names. I'm sure they have tons of things. When I typed in just phone, all of these random things came up. I did eventually find a cool rainbow one that I think I stick with at the end here. You will see me pick that. I'm gonna go ahead and save that rainbow into my custom designs. That way I can use it while I'm customizing my phone. So from here, it's exactly the way you would do anything else that you're customizing. You're gonna click on the item, you're gonna click on your custom designs, and then you're gonna click on the one that you found while you were searching. You're gonna say okay, and voila, you have a customized phone case. I'm gonna go outside and show you guys how cool it looks. You could really get super creative with this or you could just take the basic colors or patterns all in all i think it's a cute little way to look different from other people i appreciate you guys watching i hope this helped you i will see you in the next video bye